Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, my name is Ino, and he is my partner, uh, Nick. Um, today, we will talk about uh, curriculum, uh, curriculum uh, change, change and environment in New Zealand education over the last 10 years. And, yeah, and here, I have uh, five main, uh, main points to this topic. And the first one is the old system issue, and the number one, uh, the number two is the new system benefit. The number three is the alternative, and the number four is the correct, correct uh, changes, and the number five is the summary. Um, I will go into speaking to first and first one and the second one, and now then. Uh, great progress has been achieved uh, in higher education uh, where high uh, quality um, undergraduate graduate education act as a uh, principal uh, part. Um, so there are more and more uh, problems apply in the old education system. Here I find the big issue in the old education system. The first issue is the focus on uh, results. Uh, this means it's um, high stake in fail exam and many students fail. Why uh, many students fail exam? Because um, in the old education system, uh, the student um, in uh, in before the exam, uh, the student just uh, go to relax to uh, study and listen the teacher how to teach them uh, knowledge. And but in the end of the uh, term, they need to super hard work to do the exam because uh, the exam is very important. Uh, if they want to go to the university, they have to uh, pass the exam. They, they they can go to the university. And the next part is um, just the just uh, sit down and listen to teacher speaking. Um, yeah. Uh, in the old system, the normal um, a lot of people just uh, go to school, just sit down to listen to teacher speaking. They don't need think more about uh, the knowledge, they just uh, listen to the teacher uh, teach their knowledge. Uh, so they may be refueling uh, some program, yeah, because uh, no exam, no, um, they don't need super power to study to do the exams. So the student may be feel, feeling uh, feel boring. And next, uh, the number three is a uh, temper temporary study. Uh, this is uh, not very effective. Yeah. Uh, next is the new system, new education system. What is the new education system? New uh, this is the national certificate of education uh, achievement. Uh, this system is uh, including internal assessment. Um, there are uh, two point to the new system. Is it a focus on the process of learning? Uh, not only in the end of uh, semester. And the number two is belong um, mistake keep practice. Uh, this new system is I think this new system is better than old system because uh, the student need uh, super hard work in every day and because uh, the student, the student don't know uh, when they will have a test, when they have an exam to do it. So uh, they need to keep study, they need to keep super hard, they need to keep uh, keep uh, listen to uh, teacher uh, what uh, what they say. So um, and they didn't need in the end of the term to super hard to do the exam and uh, they every exam will uh, recording they uh, learn what and so I think this system is easy to um, all system so 
So and meta, yeah. And this is my uh, opinion and um, by the issue. So next part is uh, I'm Chris Mapana to speak the uh, next part. Thank you. Okay, uh, I'm going to talk about um, alternatives uh, to private school. Uh, you know, our parents always are uh, keen on uh, private schools. And in New Zealand, there are 3.5% of uh, students uh, at a private school. Uh, and uh, are private school better? Uh, let us refer to these advantages. Number one uh, is uh, private school do often uh, have better facilities. Uh, because you know uh, students spend a lot of money to and, uh, Number two, private school always uh, offer more opportunities like uh, public speaking, uh, languages and uh, musical instrument lessons on early age. And uh, number three, academic results uh, show that uh, private school outperform than public school. But also, uh, private school have uh, bigger disadvantages because uh, the highest uh, only fee uh, of uh, private school is about uh, $24,000 per year. And uh, this is almost uh, 30 times of the lowest uh, of public schools. Okay, and uh, next part I will move on to the current uh, trend. And uh, uh, there is a trend in that a few people learning languages. Mm, since 2008, the number of students learning uh, another language uh, from 25% to 20% in New Zealand. And uh, our uh, education minister said that she uh, urged all students to consider another language as it uh, benefits them and the country. So, Come up over the last 20 years, the curriculum uh, changed and uh, developed in New Zealand education. And the uh, NCA challenged all students uh, of all abilities in all areas. And, uh, Although NCEA has issues, but this new system has been uh, continually improving. And uh, NCEA and other alternatives uh, all contribute to New Zealand education. Okay, uh, thank you for listening. Uh, if you have any problem or question, I can answer. Thank you. Uh, how do you think about the private school and why? Uh, okay, uh, maybe uh, private school uh, outperform than public school. But uh, do you know uh, private schools only be is the higher than, more higher than public school. So it's uh, not uh, that uh, everyone can afford it. Thank you.
Um, I have a question um, about the old system. You said uh, in one of your slides it was just focused on exams. What what were those exams? Uh, what this means is um, in the old system, uh, the people, uh, the, the student, um, need a uh, super hard work in, uh, in the end of the, uh, uh, the term in the uh, exam. So, and before in in the end of the exam, in the, in, the, in the end of the term, um, the student uh, can relax to uh, study, and um, if have uh, some question, can uh, ask, can go to ask the teacher. At this moment, they just uh, relax, and maybe some student didn't care, and but in. In, in in the end of the of the term, they need to do the exam because this exam is very important, and they need pass this exam to uh, go to the university. So um, yeah, and this is why the uh, this exam is uh, very hard work. Uh, the student uh, need to hard work and need pass. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I, 